Hi, it's Travis from POSGuys.com. Today we're reviewing the Citizen CTE351 budget receipt printer. This is their baseline model. This is the most affordable of all their models. If you were a fan of the Citizen C310 previously, this is the model that directly replaces it. It's a very nice model and they've made some very good cosmetic as well as performance enhancements over their previous printers and we're going to kind of go through those right off the bat. This is a front exit model, top loading model. So you open up the cover, drop in the receipt printer, receipt paper, and you're good to go. So the paper comes out the front. You can have feed it by pressing the feed button. You run out of paper and you close it. You get an audible warning. You also get a little warning light that says that it's out of paper. And then you just simply drop in the new roll when you're ready to go. It's an auto cut model by default. It's a partial cut, leaving a little bit of a nub so that it hangs on the front of the receipt printer. You can set it to full cut if you wanted to. Additionally, it's 203 DPI's and it's 9.8 inches per second. So that's a really good speed and uh, the normal DPI for receipt printing. It has Windows, Android, and iOS capability. Though so you'll mostly be doing Windows uh, because in order for it to work on Android or iOS, the app has to integrate to the printer itself. Uh, and at this point, being a really new printer, it hasn't been integrated into a lot of apps. But uh, look forward to it being integrated into more apps coming forward. It prints uh, very fast. If I'm printing out a standard retail receipt, uh, using graphics on it as well. You can see it feed out at 10 inches per second. So graphics on it, fonts of different size, it's laid out correctly, uh, big order number at the bottom, uh, as well as some additional lines. So good printing and prints uh, using Epson emulation. So this will be the same as if you're uh, using an Epson receipt printer and you wanted to switch out for Citizen, your, your receipts are going to look exactly the same. You're not going to know that they're different. As far as ports are concerned, there's either a USB Ethernet model or a USB serial model. All models come with USB as that is the most common in Windows. You can see where the USB plugs in. This is your serial port if you were using serial for some reason. Uh, and then this is your cash drawer port if you're going to connect it to an external cash drawer. And then uh, your power supply plugs right into there. If you were using the Ethernet model, this serial port would be gone and it would be replaced with an Ethernet port for using it on your network. The CTE351 comes with a three year warranty. It's built by Citizen, with, which is also really well known for their watches. Uh, very high quality build. It's a nice, sturdy receipt printer, very compact. The front exit is very nice uh, as far as keeping the receipts uh, kind of tucked away. And then you can put things on top of the printer should you choose to, or if you want to push it back into like a kiosk or a counter or something that it can be pushed all the way back. You just need to pull it forward in order to load more receipt paper into it. It can use the expanded 300 foot rolls of receipt paper if you want to go with the larger rolls. Uh, it is an Energy Star model, meaning that it'll save you a little bit of energy over the year. Um, but overall, it's a good Epson emulating receipt printer, recommended mostly for Windows. It's available in both black and white. For more information on the Citizen printer or to purchase, please visit us at POSGuys.com. Thanks.